What's the crack, lads? Welcome back. We're on the last the last few players. We've got Ronaldinho Ravallo left, depending on when I upload these. We've covered all the players and the training guides. And Ronaldinho is going to be next up. We've got him from the Barcelona 0405 squad. He's a good player, man. Ronaldinho was a beast for me. He scored so many free kicks for me in eFootball 22 and 23 at the start of eFootball 2023. Um, very good player. Again, he's tied by his unwavering form. He doesn't have that. He only has standard form. But he also is a little bit fortunate that he does have possession game 80. So we can just pump in all our stats into his stats and all our progression points into his stats. Creative midfielder, 90 attacking midfielder overall, 11 levels to go, which is going to give us, what, 22 points to go, I think it is, um, when we get over to eFootball DB, or 20 points, I think, to train him up. And look, 90 dribbling, 89 tight possession of ball control. We don't need to touch his dribbling, man. That's the key about this card. We also don't really need to touch anything else with his passing because we have him as an AMF. You're going to have two options with him. So Ronaldinho is definitely one of the picks of him. Ronaldinho is a kind of a difficult player to play with, man, because his dribbling is so good that he nearly slows down the pitch too much, slows down the ball too much. Player skills, just to touch on those. One thing that you need to focus on here is his one-touch pass and his no-look pass. That is going to be something that you either love or hate because there's a lot of contextual stuff that happens with this card, extra touches. It's Ronaldinho, man. He likes a bit of flair playing with a smile on his face. So into eFootball DB, we've got 20 points to spend. We're not going to touch team play style. We're going to leave that at 80. That's fine. So what are we going to do, right? Well, if you're going to be taking a lot of shots with Ronaldinho, this is one build I would take for a cut-in, shoot and dribble attack a midfielder right so this is kind of ignoring passing right so this is one option so we're going to pop in four into shoot three into shooting to bring his curl up to 85 his finishing to 80 we're going to leave passing but we're going to extend out his dribbling to 93 94 93 ma mainly to get the dribbling up past 92 dexterity we're going to go to 90 and then we're also going to go with this to 78 and then pop two more into shooting and that's how we're going to spend our points on him if we're looking to shoot. Like if we're looking, if you score a lot of goals, curl shots, whatever, that is where we're going to go with that. Now, if we're just looking to have him as more of an all-round player, right, 80 into finishing is probably a bit overkill. I would go 78. Once his curl is over 82, you know, it could even be 82. You could just leave it at the standard. But I would pop one into that and then we're going to pump the rest into passing to bring that up. We're also going to leave the dribbling at 90. Uh, in the 91s, the early 90s there, the, late, the the very beginning of the 90s stat there, the cutoff, so one into that, one into shooting, and then dexterity, we're going to pop two more into uh, speed to get the speed up to 80 with the stamina, Ronaldinho's stamina does kill him a little bit, and we're also going to pop one more into acceleration, so that's going to be more for an all-round player if you want to go that route, we could also go one more into passing there if you want to do that as well, 85 passing that's a beastly card beastly player for Ronaldinho if you're not using Ronaldinho correctly he mightn't be good for you lads I use him as kind of you know I get caught in possession with him a lot of the time because he is a bit slower he likes to take his time on the ball he likes having that tight possession sometimes your tight possession and dribbling can be too high so don't you know make sure that you kind of train him up like this if you're looking for a very very nice all-round player and if you want a shooter kind of without the passing then you can go the first route. So that is it for Ronaldinho, lads. We've got one more left, which is Rivaldo, and then Cafu after him, and then that's it. So we will talk to you in a bit. Don't forget to subscribe if you're liking these, if they help you out. If you are a newcomer to the game, get your comments and questions in below, and any feedback or suggestions for the videos going forward, let me know. Peace.